also any update on the perpetrators of the attack. A lot, there's been a lot of chatter about KH. Can you tell us whether that is the leading suspicion right now? Uh, we know this is an IRGC-backed uh, militia. Uh, it has the footprints of Kitab Hezbollah, um, but not making a final assessment on that. Um, our, our teams here are continuing to do the analysis, but we know that um, Iran is behind it. And um, certainly, as, as we've said before here in this, in this briefing room, um, Iran continues to arm and equip these groups to launch these attacks, um, and we will certainly hold them responsible. Just clarification, you, you said you know Iran is behind it. You know that Iran and or Iranian leaders were actually behind this attack as in planned, coordinated, or directed it? We know that Iran certainly plays a role with these groups. They arm and equip and fund these groups. I don't have more to share on terms of an intelligence assessment on uh, if uh, leaders in Iran were directing this attack. But what I can tell you is that um, we know these groups are supported by Iran, um, and therefore they do have their fingerprints on this, but I can't tell you more in terms of who directed the attack. Jen. Sabrina, did this drone take off from an IRGC base in Syria? Uh, I don't have uh, more on the uh, point of origin just yet of where this attack originated from. And was it human error that failed to recognize that this was an Iranian drone coming to the base? It's something that um, Central Command is looking into to find out exactly what happened. Um, as I mentioned at the top, um, they're doing the assessment on this. They're working through what they need to do to um, make sure our service members, whether being in Jordan, Iraq, and Syria, are further protected. Um, but I just don't have more to share at this time. And lastly, what kind of drone struck the base? Is this the same kind of Iranian drone being used by the Russians in Ukraine? Um, that's something that we're looking at right now. We're assessing the drone, but I don't have more to share just yet. Dries. Just to follow up, you said Iran was behind the attack. So what does that mean? Have you seen evidence of financing or directing anything specific to this attack, not just generally, but specifically? Uh, so what, maybe I need to clarify further um, from what Lita had mentioned. We know that Iran funds these groups, like Kitab Hezbollah. We know that these IRGC-backed militias are the ones responsible for attacks on our troops in Iraq and Syria. Uh, beyond that, we're, we're doing an intelligence assessment. We don't have, I, don't, I can't give you today that, 